This is a guided meditation to connect to your inner divine feminine. I want you to find a quiet place to just take some time to get comfortable. You can sit or lie down. Just make sure your arms and legs are not crossed. I want you to close your eyes, relax, roll your shoulders back to release the energy, move your head side to side, move your body to just shake out any energy or any tension or resistance from the day, and focus on your breath, taking a deep breath in, holding it for three seconds, and release. Taking another deep breath in, holding it for three seconds, and release. One more deep breath in, holding it for three seconds, and release. You are protected, you are loved, you are secure, and you are physically present with yourself. I'm going to be calling in the goddess of love and motherhood, Hathor, to come in to help you reconnect to the energy of your inner divine feminine with love, joy, and nurturing. Helping you to remember the powerful empress energy that is within you. You will see Hathor coming towards you. There is a golden light around her. She is smiling at you. She is so happy to be with you during this meditation to help you fully embrace who you are. In her hands is an ancient book. She is going to sit down in front of you and she is going to open the book where you will be able to see what's on the pages. This could be in Egyptian, this could be in English, or your language, or it could be pictures. Take a few moments to connect to this book and what message she has for you.
The message that she has brought to you is what you need to know in this moment in time. This message is going to show you how you can stay in your divine feminine energy, how you can awaken your divine feminine to stay connected to her as you move about your day-to-day -day life, present and in the future. Everything is in the palm of your hands. Everything is where it's supposed to be. Everything is going where it's supposed to be. If you have to change your course or you've been wanting to change your course, all you need to do is make the conscious decision to do so. Everything is going to work out just the way you want it to. That is why staying in your divine feminine energy, believing, trusting, having faith, loving yourself, and making decisions that it just is because it is. You are deserving of love. You are deserving of all the things that you desire, but you must believe that to be true. Staying in your divine feminine energy is going to help you really stay focused on you. Being focused on you brings in change. It brings in a new beginning. And it brings in a solid foundation for the future. I want you to thank Hathor for helping you as you take in the energy, the messages that she has brought you. You will see her stand up with the book and you will watch her walk off into the distance with the golden light around her. So I want you to repeat after me. I am free. I am whole. I am love. I am joy. I am a nurturer. I am free. I am free to choose. I am free to believe. I am free to trust. I am free to believe. I am free to have faith. I am free to change. Change is within me. Change is what I need to do. I am my own reason to rise again. I am the Divine Feminine. I am me. I do not settle. I only rise to the occasion to be my own phoenix, my own inspiration. I do not chase. I attract what wants me by simply being me. I want you to start coming back to your body, feeling your fingers, your hands, your arms, your neck, your throat, your chest, your torso, hips, legs, feet and toes, your chin, your lips, your cheeks, your eyes, your forehead and the top of your head. And when you're ready, open your eyes and reflect on this meditation. Reflect on all that has come through for you. Knowing that you have the power to be who you want to be by simply shifting into your divine feminine energy and being your own reason to rise again.